Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for tomorrow or whenever it resonates. We're just, you know, because the timing is fluid for these dailies, this is just the message I am picking up on today. Could be resonating at any time. This is for whoever it resonates with. Keep in mind that these uh, readings are usually for who needs them the most at the time. Sorry I wasn't here yesterday. Um, I took a minute off. So here I am. Here I am. The rest of the March monthlies will be done um, Saturday or Sunday. So I know I have six more to go. I haven't forgotten. They're going to go in order. I've already done Aries through Virgo. So Libra through Pisces will be done next within the next two days. Um, thank you for your patience. And thank you for being part of my channel. So we're going to get one of these. We're going to get one of these. And then we're going to use that deck right there. What do we have? Dear God, angels, spirits, and universe. We have a major new beginning. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Somebody does. Something new is starting. Something new is starting. Um, I just had a glimpse of the world, not in the card, just the world card. The world. That's why I said that. So, um... These are not reversed. These are overall energies. So, <laughs> yes, we do have a new beginning, okay? A passionate one. A new spark. New flame. There could be an instant attraction that comes about. So, I hope you're ready for it. Okay, so th that's just wonderful right there. Um... That could be a new drive within yourself. You may have this new vision. You may have this new desire or this new ambition. You know, all of a sudden you got this new <sighs> desire to start over or this new desire to take a new approach or go down a new path. Or This is a passionate new endeavor or a passionate new partner. Could be either way. This is passion. This is the wand of passion. Okay, this could be a new sexual partner. There could be an instant attraction. Some of you, you know, you could walk into a room, you meet eyes with somebody, and boom. That could be the case. This, it could go many different routes. That's just one card. Okay. It's a new desire. It's a new passionate beginning. That's what it is. New passionate start. New flame. Oh, the thinking woman. We get her a lot, don't we? She's probably thinking because she's going to be looking at this in a minute. She is. She's going to be looking at that passion. So she's going to have to make some sort of decision. So it looks like we have a very intelligent woman that may be faced with making a decision as to whether she wants to start over or go down this road or what she wants to do. You know, where does where do her passions lie? Maybe that's what she's thinking about, you know. What do I need to do to live again? Because this is lighting a fire, you know, relighting a fire, however it uh, applies to you. We definitely have a woman that is going to be thinking about, you know, <laughs> whether she wants to do it or not. Um, if you are the man watching this, you could be the one that's approaching this woman and she has a lot to think about, whether she wants to go down this road or not, whatever the case is. Um... What else? What else do we got? I will focus this in after. What do we have? What's going on here? What do you want? What are you going to do? Oh, yay! The Six of Cups. Somebody from the past, perhaps. Somebody you have known before. You know, this does not mean I am gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna really explain the Six of Cups for you now. The Six of Cups is somebody that you have known before. Memories. You have some sort of memories with this person, whoever it is. Doesn't mean it's the one that um broke your heart. Could be. It could be. This could be anybody. I mean if you think about your past, how many people have you had in your past? How many people have you 
you know, flirted with? How many people have did you grow up with? You know, somebody from your past may be returning to your life, and you really got to think about this. This does not mean it's the person that you don't want. It could be the person you don't want, but it might not be. It could be somebody else. Like I said in one of my other readings, a lot of times I used to, a long time ago, think whenever I heard it was somebody from my past, I always thought it was my ex. And then somebody else would show up, and I'd be like, oh my God. You know, I had that one track mind. No, somebody from the past could be anybody. So somebody that you've known before, you may have... You may come into contact with, maybe unexpectedly, and now you got to think about it. Jeez, they're just a flopping. Ooh! He. Yikes. So, we have a very beautiful woman here. Some somebody that is very nurturing very caring very compassionate and knows her worth and she will not settle for less and that's why she's thinking so much that she's a thinker she's very intelligent she's very abundant she has a lot of life experience behind her back and she probably has her guard up she's probably fending off many okay um this is obstacles being removed Somebody may have removed themselves from a situation that was keeping them trapped. And now they want to, to fight for this woman. I don't know. That's kind of funny. I don't know who that would be. Um, but that could certainly be the case. Could be somebody from your past. This woman, um, it could be some, this is a mother and this is children. So this could be the mother of children. Um, there could be children involved. Um, whoever this woman is, she's very motherly. She's very nurturing. She is I mean, she's, she's it. She's it. And she knows that she's it. That's the thing. She does know. She will not settle. And she doesn't, it's not like she's conceited. She just knows. She knows what she is worth. She knows. And this person sees it. So this person knows that she knows. And he's like, hmm. <gasps> this, is a, this is a big, huge, huge, huge opportunity. Remember I said a major new beginning. I saw the world card. But there is absolutely no doubt that we have a new beginning here. Because these are both new beginnings. This is something that could be very, very attractive to you. Definitely, there's an attraction here, and it could lead to something good, okay? If you go down that path, you could get a something really stable, secure, solid, long-term, um, really, really good out of this if you go down that path. But I feel like this woman now she's looking at, she knows what she has to offer, and she probably sees that this could lead to something so we have a new we have a new beginning here <laughs> yes we do yes we do um oh my god this is looking really really good it could lead to happiness this is a time of rebirth i mean if you think about the empress she gives birth to a new life and this is rebirth as well so it looks like we have rebirth here and i said major new beginning it's funny how that happens so we have a we have a new beginning that is probably coming in that could lead to a lot of happiness. It could lead to bliss. It could lead to renewal. And this is renewal. There could be a rebirth or a renewal of a, or a rekindling of a relationship with somebody that you have known from the past. And like I said, it does not mean it's the one that stabbed you. Although it could be. It could be. Um, oh boy, yikes, but there's resent and there's bitterness, <laughs> a lot of it, there's distrust, it's like there's a person, this thinking, this is who we're talking about here, this is a thinking woman, she doesn't trust, she doesn't trust, this is a 47, she doesn't trust, she doesn't trust, and she doesn't trust. She doesn't trust because she's been hurt so bad in the past. She's been used and abused. 
And because she's been used and abused, it's like, huh, you know, I'm not sure that I believe. I'm not sure that I believe that, you know, this is real. Oh, son of a bitch. I'm sorry. Oh, God. This is crazy. Um... <laughs> I'm just going to keep shuffling for a minute here. It's like I have, I have enough. I have enough on my own. I'm stable. I'm solid. I'm secure. Um, and I know what I have to offer. Remember I told you we, we have a woman here that knows what she's worth. We do. She know, we know, she knows what she's worth, but she doesn't trust. She has trust issues. She does have trust issues. She sees that there's an opportunity for happiness, but... There's been obstacles, there's been lies, you know, there's been a need to defend themselves. And it's like we all of a sudden we have this person that may want to protect this woman or may want to fight for this woman. And she's like, damn, I have so much to offer that I just don't know if I can give it to you. I don't know if you're worthy. I don't know if you are worthy. Um, yeah. She's abundant. So we have a very we have a very abundant woman here. There's no doubt. Very abundant woman here that has trust issues. And, you know, she's got her guard up. She's trying to protect herself. She's trying to protect her her abundance, you know, herself. She's trying to, you know, make the right decision. And somebody may want a reconciliation or somebody may want a second chance. And she's like, I just don't know. I just don't know. She doesn't have faith in it. She doesn't have faith that, or it may be even somebody new, because I don't know, I, I'm not sure. It could be somebody new with these two cards. It could be somebody new. And she may not trust because of the past. That could be why this card is here. The past really used and abused her. And she has been trapped, mentally trapped in her own prison for long enough. And perhaps she's finally stepped out of her mental prison and she's found her self-worth again. And now she has multiple opportunities because she is the Empress. When you become the Empress, the opportunities, they come a-flying in. Trust me, I know. They come flying in. And it's like, it's, but she still doesn't dare to give anybody a chance for some reason. I don't know why. Well, I do know why, because she's been hurt so badly. She doesn't trust. She doesn't trust. Yeah, she doesn't she doesn't feel like there'll be victory and success. You know, she she probably doesn't have confidence that anybody will come to her upright, you know? Is this is this real? Is this true? Is this person noble? You know, is there any follow through here? So, I feel like there is somebody has manifested a Maybe it's, it could be a rekindling, or it could be a new partnership. Now we, now it's right. Now it's here. Now it's here. Okay. Now we got this arrival. Okay, of some sort. And now we got this woman who just doesn't trust it. She doesn't believe. She doesn't, you know, have faith that this could lead to anything successful. And it's because she knows what she's worth. She does. She really knows what she's worth. She's dealt with a lot of pain. We definitely have a woman that has dealt with a lot of pain here. And now she's got this opportunity being offered to her that could lead to something really, really, really good. But she's not sure if she wants to settle. And she's fine being independent. Okay, she is. She's really good. She's she's fine. She knows that she's good independent. But, you know, <clears throat> what is this? What is this Seven of Wands? It looks like somebody may be wanting to get in the game. You know, I want I want a piece. <laughs> I want a piece. Isn't that funny? Uh-oh. King of Swords. Ah. This is Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. We have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Libra, Taurus, or, uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Leo, Scorpio. It could be anybody. These are just, I'm just, I don't even know why I named them off. There really could be anybody here. I feel like we have somebody that is going to go after what they want. I think we have a male that is going to come forward very um, adamantly 
with what he wants. It's like he knows what he wants and he's going after it. So I feel like we have a man here that is like going to do what he do what he needs to do. It's like he's he's made a decision that I want this queen. <laughs> yes. Yes. I want this queen and you know, I'm going to have to uh get in this game whoever it is. He knows that she has multiple options too. He's probably going to see that she has or he does see that she has multiple options. You know, I feel like we have a a man here that has made a decision that I want this, I want a chance. And he's going to he's going to speak up. He's going to speak up. Oh, God. This woman has walked away from something that has been emotionally disappointing. She has. She has turned her back on something that is emotionally disappointing. And she's probably been talking to the moon and saying her prayers and begging. Begging for somebody that would protect her and begging for somebody that would stand up for her and not let her down. And I think her prayers are going to be answered. Okay. And, but even though her prayers are going to be answered, she still doesn't trust. Mm. There's indecision. This is indecision. She's definitely going to be indecided. Now all of a sudden it's here. You're at this crossroads. You got to make this choice. You'll be, this is it. This is it. You got to make a choice. This is a choice. Do you want this or not? You you have an opportunity here to unite with somebody. You do. And there's probably a soulmate connection. This is a soulmate connection. And when you get the two, the king and queen of any suit, there's a soulmate connection here, okay? Something that probably needs to learn, be learned from this whole situation. Put it that way. So, you know, now you've got this opportunity. It's right in front of you. It's right in your face. It is. It's right in your face. This person is communicating. They're communicating. They see, I mean, they see your worth. They see what you have to offer. What the hell? Oh, I stopped it. Siri was about to come on. But the phone was in reach. Now I'm going to try to get Siri to come on now. Let's see if it works. Hey, Siri. Hey, Siri, I see. I see. I see. That's how it comes on. I see. So when I say I see, it comes on. That's funny. I see. It's still not coming on. I see. Anyhow, we're done with that. Um, it threw me off track for a minute. Anyway... Um, somebody is, it's right in your face. Like I said, it's, it's right in your face. And now you have to make a decision. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? What you've been wanting, what you, what you have been manifesting. This is, this is the card of manifestation, manifestation along with the magician. It's here. You know, you got this, this huge gift, this huge opportunity that you have wished for, that you have manifested. And now you have to make a, make a decision. And I see that there's indecision here as to whether you want it now that it's right in your face. Um, oh, could lead to love. This is the love that you have manifested. This is a new, I mean, one one, one. Your thoughts become things. Remember I said your prayers have been being answered. You have a new opportunity. Whoever this reading is for, there is a man that is very... 
authoritative okay this man has made a decision whoever this man is could be any sign we have a man that knows what he wants and he is going to go after it. it's like he has the power he has the power in his hand that is the sort of power it's the sort of truth it's the sort of communication it's like he's wide awake he knows what he wants he sees this woman's worth he's coming after her and now she is undecided because she has been burned but this is a love connection it is a real love connection that could lead to something solid, stable, emotionally fulfilling, with a whole lot of passion, okay? So, I hope you're ready for this. Um, good luck. I'm going to get an angel romance card just for the hell of it. I don't know who this reading is for, but we got a new love connection here that's probably unexpected. It is unexpected because she's going to be thrown off kilter. She is. She's going to be like, oh my God, this is what I wanted, but now I'm scared of it. <sighs> Remember I told you you manifested this? By setting your intentions, you did. Very soon, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Somebody's prayers are being answered. If you haven't manifested it and you've been thinking negatively and you've been moping and you've been down in the dumps, you better get on that. One, one, one. Your thoughts truly do become things. Expect the unexpected. We got <laughs> passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. This is what you asked for. <laughs> 